Greetings once again from Sage and me. She's come to sit with us for a little bit, I think. Um, so, hello Sage. <laughs> Be good now. You can you sit there. Right. Um, we continue with this piece. Um, whether or not we complete today is anyone's guess. Um, but we'll we'll make a good we'll make a good effort. Um, yeah, and there's a few condolences today because uh, um, I heard that uh, an old family friend passed away last last evening. Um, Life Hansen. So uh, a very a very a very nice man um, indeed. Um, always joking around, always laughing, always full of smiles and. Good things to say. Um, so, uh, yeah, he uh, he was a, a very fine gent, and uh, so he'll be greatly missed. So, condolences to his family. Um, and then my girlfriend Wendy's little Garfield cat had to be put down this morning. So, uh, condolences there too. Shame, little soul. Um, May he rest in peace. And it's also the 40th anniversary of my my mum's mum's passing on. So um, to Nana, thinking of you, um, wherever you may run. <laughs> yeah, so uh, this session, has, I guess, is in memory of all those, all those gone and passed. Um, so uh, a rather a sombre mood this morning. Um, today, um, yes. Anyway, perhaps it's it's kind of perhaps this piece is and its and its mood is kind of reflective of that um, today. So uh, I uh, I shall bear this in mind as I as I work on this piece today. Um, yeah, how how fleeting life is and also how um, how we should cherish it whilst living um, cherish our own lives whilst we are alive and what we have in our lives whilst we have it and those that we have in our lives whilst we have them so yes a little a little pondering goes a long way, a little reflection. Contemplation. Yeah, when I when I think of when I think of these kind of things, and uh, and then this whole scenario with with Facebook and Instagram, as I was explaining yesterday, having been having been shut out for no fault of my own, um, those kinds of things are just insignificant, aren't they? Um, yeah. <laughs> You know, back in whenever Facebook began, or you know, I think it was two thousand and seven, perhaps. Um, I only joined in two thousand and nine, but <laughs> my life is no different now than it was back then. Um, when it comes to the need for social media, really, yeah. Um, aside of being in touch with friends around the world and, and even then I don't need Facebook really when it comes down to it because golly it's a, it's it's a, it's really it's a superficial thing and other than and there are many other means of, of maintaining contact with with those particularly dear to you 
Um, and it's just not all it's, it's cracked up to be these days. Uh, I think that with all the rules and regulations, yes, of course they're necessary. Um, but with the, 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 the manner in which so social media platforms, the size of Facebook and Instagram have grown, there are many multiple millions engaging, interacting on a daily basis. And of course, you're going to find the hackers and the, the ne'er-do-wells um, alike um, all mixing in very difficult to police also very difficult to follow up on all these cases of people's accounts being hacked and so on and they've got the numbers so they can just close them off for it for, for good in, in any case and not lose lose a night's sleep over that that's for sure anywho um so it's obviously being made impossible for me to to actually get in I was trying again after my session yesterday. It's impossible. <laughs> they, 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 they require that you um, provide an image via the, uh, via the app of your, uh, an, an image of your identification. So your driving license, your passport, your ID document, whatever it might be. So they require that, and and there's a there's a facility within the application, Facebook application, to take an image, take a photograph of your of your document, and send it through to them. And of course, I was doing that, and every time I tried to upload the thing, it said it, it kept on coming back and saying that it was too large to to upload. I mean, goodness me! So they're making it harder and harder and harder for me to. I'm just going to give up. So I can't even start. I can't even start a new a new profile on Facebook for that same reason. Goodness me, it's just absolutely impossible and so infuriating. I'm, I've wasted so much time on this now, and I'm just ready to throw it all in. So another friend of mine has suggested I perhaps focus, obviously, on 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 my remaining um, my YouTube account which I still have obviously um, and and also on TikTok so um, I'm going to start also looking into that I do have a TikTok account and I do have a couple of, of a couple of uploads there so um, um, if you want to find me and follow me for future for future reference then uh, I think it's just Guy McGowan, once again, or Guy Dot McGowan, I'm not sure, but anyway, um, I can post short, um, short clips up on there as well, and engage with people live as well, and all that sort of stuff. So yeah, that's a that's a whole new thing, um, and I'm definitely going to ex be exploring that most definitely. Um, I'm, I'm, I think. Facebook is now, I'm done with it, I'm done with it, I'm over it, and they can go sit and swivel, for all I care. The fact that there's no no recourse in terms of in terms of personal and interaction with somebody who can review one's account and what transpired um you can't do that so what am i left with what options are, am i left with none And I require a social media platform of some kind. So, in addition to YouTube, of course. That's 
that's a prerogative and uh, Facebook is not prepared to provide that for me well so be it I did say yesterday uh, in the previous session that I was going to look into alternatives to Facebook as well and there are a number of them I did I did some research oh maybe a year ago or so but uh, just out of just out of interest but um, um, and there were a couple of platforms available seemingly more a little more authentic than Facebook so let's 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 give that a go I think the most important thing though now is to is to actually is to get my get a website going I, I have I don't have one I, I did have one but I no longer have one but uh, and I really need to get that going and I've been saying that for some time now so I guess this is the this is the the final straw and really needs to get done so I have a few missions to accomplish Thank goodness I have actually been building my YouTube account, YouTube channel these past, or oh, I suppose the past year or so now, um, because now all of my videos are loaded up there and I was just sharing them through to Facebook, but at least they're there and, and, and of course I suppose any social media platform is 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 open to uh, is open to hacking and and uh, and so on, but perhaps not quite so much as what Facebook is. Being video, being primarily primarily video, so. Um, one never knows the it just is the luck of the draw. Oh goodness, it's what I do realise is that there are a lot of malicious people out there. Because there's no gain to be made from hacking people's accounts and doing stuff like this, doing this posting up whatever child pornography or whatever it is that was and happened in, in my instance but really there's nothing to be gained it's just sheer maliciousness and that shows you what people are like Some very, very messed up people out there. Very disturbed. Hear the monkeys on the roof, and they're all about today. I don't want to 
to do is you can add to this. So basically just doodling away today, uh, I'm just taking my time in reflection and uh, I'm not going to rush this piece so it's not a problem if I don't finish it during this session. And I'm going to make it a 45 minute session so uh, um, yeah, so yeah. If I don't finish during this session, I'll complete it tomorrow. Easy peasy like lemon squeezy.
So I'm using my uh, charcoal conjunction with the pastel just to accentuate these contrast, deep contrasting shadowy areas or, or darker areas. Um, just working it up slowly, slowly, slowly. So as I was, as I made mention um, yet, uh, during the previous session, there's this this particular part over here where there's quite a lot of refracted light, uh, refracted sunlight um, that is playing on the uh, on this on the the sandy bed. Uh, under about. Uh, six inches of water, a foot of water, I don't know. Um, and that's just sort of a dancing light. So I'm going to be working with that a little bit as well. Um, I'm just setting the, setting the scene at the moment, sort of um, including some vegan poo brown um, color, <laughs> whatever it's called. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so it's a little bit of lighter, lighter um, light play going on here, um, right up in the foreground. So browns, lighter sort of greens, etc. And I'm going to be, I'm going to be accentuating this sort of dancing light with. Uh, like a, like a pale yellow so uh, later on much later on of course in the meanwhile it's this is all about building layers building layers of color which adds integrity which adds um, dimension perspective and all of these wonderful things so And of course, contrast. <clears throat> so that's my mission at this point.
and of course a great deal of doodling um, and the more I work up my doodling the more this starts to gain form meaning language etc A little bit more work on the buildings and so on here. Just a wee bit more. Um, just sort of slowly working them up a little bit. Blending, but not any significant detail. Hello little Finn, did you come to say hello as well? Good, it's a nice cup, come and say hello, there we go, I think it's little Finn, well not so little anymore actually, you would notice how she's grown if you look back in any of the other, uh, <laughs> the up, more recent uploads, but, uh, and, and the last one being three weeks ago, so uh, the last ones being three weeks ago, last artwork, and uh, so yeah, she's grown significantly. Well, they both have, Sage and Finn. Hey, so... Oh, Finn is the younger one by a couple of weeks. And uh, already she's significantly heavier than Sage. Quite amazing. So she's going to be a, a large black cat. I'm just hoping that that sound that I can hear through in the lounge is not a monkey. Even though there's nothing really much for it to take, but... Or maybe it's just Sage. Can I help you, Finn? 
Sage. Come. I think I just have to go and have a look. Just excuse me one moment and view my piece from a distance. Yes, indeed, monkeys, monkeys galore. But uh, as I said, there's nothing much to take, um, so they can't cause any too much mess or damage or anything like that. Nothing for them to steal. I don't leave anything out for them. But they always try. There's always new youngsters that want to try and. See what is up for grabs, if anything. Right, I think what I need to use, I haven't for some time, is my eraser. Do think that they're back and I don't I do I just need to chase them out so just excuse me once again <laughs> excuse the delay monkeys tend to do though sometimes is leave a little turd by the window um, and it looks like they have but nothing worse than that <laughs> anyway the joys the joys of not having a production team to go and take care of <laughs> to take care of business while I'm while I'm busy in recording <laughs> it's you know it's interesting though you know uh, uh, that in this age of technology that that what it takes to simply record a, a, a record and upload a videos workshops whatever it might be and you know, in, in 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 years gone by, you needed a whole studio, highly advanced and sophisticated, with lots of equipment and lighting and all sorts of things. How the world has changed, hey? Eh? To hear where. I think the more real it is, the better. The more authentic it is. Um, the more believable it is. That all it takes is a is a is a phone with a with a camera, a smartphone, and you can record. You can edit even. Well, I I I haven't quite. I, I don't bother with editing any of my videos because they uh, it just it, it, it that just takes unnecessary effort it's it's really not necessary um, but one can do all these things with with very few resources I mean it doesn't take much financially then you can start getting into 
to getting more advanced with your with your videos and and what have you and you can do it more professionally etc but it doesn't it isn't it, it isn't that necessary and uh, it just shows you how times have changed so dramatically and not in a not in a very in, not over a long period of time either in a very short space of time really um, I mean how long we have we had this capacity to to record upload how long has how long has Instagram been around I, you know I, you know um, how long has TikTok been around it, it's it's a, a matter of just a few short years not even a decade for goodness sake and and we've already got this we've become so advanced you know it's it's both a it's both our mankind's greatest and i've said this before this kind of technology and the internet and everything else is man's greatest accomplishment and yet also man's primary achilles heel because so much better you know just like i've been just like i've been uh, um moaning about with regards to facebook and instagram and what have you and so you so easily shut out for no apparent reason of your well of your own creation um and yet you've got this this uh, uh, you know um and i haven't even Got, gone seriously into and I've got what 200 and something subscribers on my YouTube channel and and I haven't even really gone full tilt in terms of in terms of building it as a building my channel and building my um, subscribers and and, and, and it's, it just I've, it's just grown sort of organically and along the way um, So yes, it's interesting, very, very interesting how the world changes before our very eyes, <clears throat> almost, and yet we become so sort of blasé about it, don't we? But it's, it's also, in, in its rapid change, it also becomes unruly and unmanageable and you know um, and this is why I said to you like Facebook has grown to such a degree and so so rapidly that they can't actually keep up with with actually managing the authenticity of their of 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 their subscribers so yeah, crazy. Absolutely crazy. And obviously it becomes so much easier then for uh, the wrongdoers to do their to do their dirty deeds, um, you know, with impunity. Almost, it seems it's it's it's. You know, I've got a I've got a friend whose mother's whose mother's uh, bank account is constantly being attempted. Uh, access is constantly being attempted, and uh, and this actually bugger all the banks can do about it, other than you know you close your accounts or change your access and I uh, you know but still they try still they keep on still they keep on calling these people that professing to be the bank um, 
trying to gain access, trying to, you know, an elderly person, trying to get them to divulge their information, etc., etc., on and on and on, and they just keep on. And you block them and they come from another number and, and so on and so forth. It's just unending. They are relentless. They must succeed because, you know, otherwise, why is it a problem? It's horrendous, though. You know that, that 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 this sort of stuff continues. So we've got a, on one hand, a very twisted, bastard world. Okay, they are back again. These lucky monkeys. They're worse than the hackers. We have. One little, little baby monkey, tiny monkey, who just keeps on coming back in and uh, and tries to fiddle with things and knocks things around. Anyway, um, yeah. So on the one hand, you've got this this really vicious world um, of. relentless venom on the other hand you've got wonderful things that are happening all the time um, has it always been like that? I don't know, I haven't lived long enough um, but I do know that with the advent of the internet and social media platforms, etc., etc. The the world has sped up. How we do life is increased a thousandfold. The world did used to be a simpler place. It didn't advance at the at the, at the levels that it, it has done in the last twenty years. You know, like I said, back in the day before, before Facebook and what have you, and it was it was it was simpler. We found other things to do. It it, it, it life has become so complicated with, with um, you know. I don't know. It breeds narcissism. People realize that they can fake it and still have followers. Even the most arbitrary of people, of narcissists, can, can actually get a following and that, that feeds their ego. And, and, and so there's that side of things. And millions upon millions of people apply them, apply themselves, and give energy to these, to these uh, leeches, these energy leeches, which is crazy. <laughs> I don't know why I'm talking such rubbish today. Um, anyway. <laughs> So be it. I have to ponder once in a while. I, 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 maybe I should reserve that for, reserve my, um, some of my mental meanderings for, uh, for TikTok or something. <laughs>
right, so what I did want to do. So down here is what used to be, I think, well, I don't know if it still is, Mayo's. So it's a little pier down here with a little, what used to be a little structure on the at the end of the pier where people could go and drink and have uh, oysters and what have you. So it's just, I'm not even, I'm, I'm just giving, a nod, giving it a nod. I'm not even uh, describing it very accurately. Um, but it's there for Patrick, my friend. He loves Mayo's. <laughs> I think Pat has has this hatred for 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 Mayo's purely because it's so just about every Tom, Dick, and Harry with a with a with a professional camera has to take these moody photographs of of the pier at at at, at Mayo's. Um, ad nauseum uh, <laughs> you almost don't see you you almost don't see a picture of durban beachfront without without mayo's being represented somewhere along the, <laughs> along the line. and patrick absolutely detests that anyway him being a being a professional surf photographer of old um yeah, it's just those, some of those, you, you, you just don't go there type of scenarios, you know. Uh, and I kind of tend to agree. It's like, oh God, that again. Um, so that's why I'm just, it's there and, and, and that's all. It's it's just a, a little blip on the radar, really. Nothing more. So I'm describing this this skyline, this this beachfront skyline with uh, a little black, but more blues, dark lilacs, etc. A little and a little charcoal, just to work it up slightly so that it's it's there, it's smudging a little here and there. Um, of course, using my eraser. Oh, that's what I was doing before I left to, to go and admonish the monkeys how are we doing for time here goodness me are we doing yeah we're we're about 45 minutes now i fear so yeah i'm going to call it a day actually and uh and take it up tomorrow once again um and finish it finish the piece tomorrow quite comfortably so uh yeah a lot of reflection a lot of observation today about stuff about life um about loss um and yes i think this piece def most definitely does reflect that kind of that kind of uh that kind of a mood a contemplative mood of of change of um reflection reflection refraction um of contrast different ideas different scenarios different moods etc so yeah I'm enjoying this and I think it's perfect for today uh, and perfect for tomorrow probably as well. But uh, nevertheless, thank you for joining. Thank you for bearing with me um, today. Um, I know it's been a, a kind of little, a little bit melancholy, um, you know, with um, with all these passings or remembering the, 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 these passings. So, um, yes, thank you for joining. Um, thank you for caring. Thank you for sharing, as always. Um, and I, uh, I bid you oodles and oodles of toodles, of course. And uh, so I shall see you again for the final round of this piece. And in the meantime, take care. Be good. Be kind. Be gentle. Be caring. Be loving. Etc. Etc. 
and be appreciative of those around you and the life that you have. So, uh, yeah, do take care. Have a fantastic day ahead and catch you again next time, folks. Bye. And don't forget to doodle.